here some stearic acid and as you can see it's in the bottom of the test tube it's a solid at room temperature so what we're going to do is we're going to add some hot water to this beaker and we're going to wait until all the solid stearic acid has turned into a liquid once it's all turned into a liquid we're going to transfer it to this beaker and we're going to start the stopwatch and every minute we're going to record the temperature of the stearic acid and we're going to use this to plot a cooling curve Okay, as you can see, all of the stearic acid has turned into liquid. So now I'm going to remove it from the hot water and put it into the empty beaker. I'm going to record the temperature now at zero, and then I'm going to start the stopwatch.